Hey guys, RC here. Welcome back. Football Manager 19, Club 4, Episode 7. Uh, we are in Brazil. We have finally made it to Brazil. We're in the second division and we are into uh, league play. Uh, as I mentioned last episode, if you haven't seen it yet, go back and check it out. Uh, we were going to play a long stretch uh, the announcement has been made for the release of Football Manager 20, and uh, we are in the home stretch. Uh, the pre-release beta will be coming out on November 5th, three weeks from yesterday as I record this, uh, even closer by the time you see this. So let's take a look at what's been going on. All right, so we made it through the fifth round. Uh, we lost our, uh, well, no, let's see. <laughs> I don't remember where we left off. Was it the home leg or the away leg or the home leg? Uh, I think it was the, I think we saw the, that we advanced. So we saw this. So we were one and one here, two and two, uh, starting second division play. We lost our third league match. Jefferson scored early. We gave up a late uh, goal right before half and then a late game winner to Man Manuel Lucas. Uh, but then we've been on a pretty good run. Uh, we beat uh, SPT 3-1. to one. Gumarez with a brace. Augustin Rojas, the talented midfielder with a late goal. Uh, they did have a player sent off in the 63rd minute. Then we uh, played ALA. 1-1 uh, draw, Rooster with a goal, uh, both teams scoring within seconds of one another. Uh, they We scored first, they got the kickoff highlight, so that was brutal. Uh, then we beat CEA 4-0, Gumaras was sent off in the 90th minute. Uh, Adilo Taquez with a brace, Rooster scored again, Columbari our, from the back line scored uh, insurance goal. Uh, four nil easy win. Then we beat beat uh, Tom. Uh, that is Ton Bentz Football Club, something like that. Uh, four to one. Pepe with uh, a extra time goal in the first half and a stoppage time goal in the second half. Takez with another goal and Romulo Frank, our captain, with a 91st minute goal. I had an email pop up and I don't remember. It was somewhere in this run. We got an offer for about $900,000, $950,000 for Frank. And he's valued at $1.1, so it was pretty close to his value. Um, he's got a 12... I, I guess these release clauses are just for shits and giggles because nobody pays that. Um I guess you're probably close to that for foreign clubs, uh, but nobody nobody has seemed willing to pay anywhere near a contract release clause, and the players don't seem to really care that they have a release clause in their contract either. Uh, but the board accepted. I got an email from the president that they had accepted the offer, and it gave me the opportunity to protest it, which I did, and I said... This guy's our, and, and the, it gave me a list. I chose the one that said, this guy's our captain. He's a team leader, and this could really gut the team and affect our play. I urge you to reconsider. And they said, you know what? You're right. He is our captain, and we are playing well. We don't want to mess that up. And they, re they reneged on the, uh, on the offer. So I was like, whew. So... It would have been nice for that money, but I didn't want to make do without the player, especially at that position, right? Uh, so let's see. That was this one. Uh, we played... Uh, I can't make any... Gaiani, Gairani. Uh, anyway, a 2-2 draw. Pepe and Lozano with late goals after we went down 2-0. Uh, against PAR, 2-1 to one win. They got an 89th minute penalty. Rooster with a goal. Jeff Jefferson. Jefferson with a goal. Uh, then we beat uh, Fortaleza. 4-1. Four Rojas. Taquez with first half goals. Pepe with a nice brace in the second half. And then we beat uh, 
Ofec, uh, 2-0 Pepe and Jefferson with the goals there. So if we look at the competition, we are currently sitting second in the second division on 26 points. Uh, so we are sitting pretty good. We have the highest goal differential, which is always nice. Uh, we are six points behind ALA, who we play today in the Brazilian Cup, uh, and we'll probably lose. We were only expected to reach the third round. We're in the quarters, so that is what it is. And what else? Uh, let's see. So you can see the clubs down there in relegation, uh, just so you guys could see all that. But we are doing pretty well. So we had lost three out of our first five, and we really haven't lost a league match since then. Eight wins, two draws, and uh, so we are pulling points pretty well at this time. Uh, getting into the schedule for today, we're going to play the, the away leg of the quarterfinal, and we'll probably come back and play the, the home leg unless we just get destroyed, in which case we'll come back probably for... MCL, we'll see. But anyway, uh, also, what else is going on? We loaned out Dela Cruz. And we brought in this guy, Fabio Tatavito. Uh, he is a center back, 19 years old, four and a half star potential. Pretty decent physicals. I'd like his acceleration to be a little bit better, but he's only 19. Very good mentals and uh, good marking, good tackling. He can head the ball pretty decently already. I think he's going to develop pretty well. So we picked him up as a young player, and I am keeping an eye on Takez for the final six months of his deal. Um, and as soon as I've tried to make an offer for end of contract, uh, they're not having any of it. Um, I'm going to make another offer. End of season, 40% fake offer. We'll throw that out there. I just want him to know. Uh, what about his uh, attributes? Nope. Dynamics. That's what I want. Oh, I am uh, favored personnel. So he, he likes me a lot. And he's playing well. Oh, my God, he's playing well. So, let's see. We are 20 goals in 25 matches. Uh, he has set a club record with uh, – he's equaled the club record with 20 goals. So, his next goal breaks the club record for a single season. Uh, you did see how many games we have left in the season, right? I'm guessing he's going to break that. Unless he breaks a leg. God, I hope that doesn't happen. Uh, Rooster is on 14, and that gives him 64 goals. I believe the record was 65, 9 and 17. Boy, he is having a career season himself. So he's going to break the club record. Takez might break it this season. I doubt it, but. He's got a shot at 30 to 35 goals, I think, realistically. Pepe's got 8 in 10, and he's really come on late. Rojas, 7 in 20. And look at the assist. Taquez with 5, Rooster with 7, Rojas with 4, Jefferson with 6. That's just crazy. I mean, even Lozano, look at that, 7 assists from the right back position. Uh, or, you know, he's also playing defensive mid. Um, everybody's scoring goals. Even I mean, you know, we don't have – we've got two people in double figures. We've got four people that could reach double figures realistically. So it's just insane. And I don't know how much of that is the talent, the team, the league, the number of matches because we played a shit ton of matches, right? Um, I know Rooster's been here all season. So if we look at this, he's got two non-competitive, 17 league, 11 cups. It's 28 total matches, 14 and 28, 1 and 2, 7 assists, 1 and 4. That's just pretty crazy. So, uh, yeah, anyway, let's get to it. I just kind of wanted to go over everything, get you caught up. 
So we are, we are on the road. We are underdogs. We have yet to beat this club. I am going to go to the 4141. I've been playing that on the few occasions that we have been serious underdogs, right? So let's get into it. It would be nice to be able to advance. Uh, pick up where you left off. All right, we're in the maroon burgundy with the yellow trim. They really dominated us the last time we played. All right, Medina. All right, their highlight. Uh-oh. Oh, man. Lucas Silva, his 10th goal of the season, just dropped over the head of our center back, and he was wide open. Get creative. They're inspired. Marcelo is overwhelmed. Indio, a little good, some good bendage on that ball. Eight to one on shots. Rojas picks up a yellow. Demand more. Focused. Tuck has a little bit of pressure. Eight to three on shots. 10% possession advantage. I'm going to transition over to here, but I am going to drop. this to support All right, we are playing higher but we're not we're not playing the extremely high so that's all right all right it was disappointing play it calm some rain coming down now All right, we get an early shot. Damn. Nothing going on there. Uh, let's see. Mid left. I'm going to put Pepe in there. And Prakel for Rojas. All right, Pepe, Gamaras, Romulo Frank. Uh, he plays it out to Columbari. Back into Frank. Pertel. Back to Frank. Gamaras. Takes a touch. Drills it into the right side of the net. Top bends. Fifth goal of the season. Nice ball movement. Looking for the opening. Uh, we've we've been really hot this half. Push forward. We've got them on their back heel. Maybe not. No, no, no. All right. Nice save. Nice save. <laughs> All right, uh, let's see. Marala, defensive right wing back. Lozano, let's bring you in for him. He's got a bunch of assists. Maybe that'll get uh, get the ball for us. I'll actually be happy with a 1-1 draw here. On the road, one away goal. I think we'd be all right. Now, if we could steal it here, that would be incredible. Lozano, Frank Romulo. 
Plays it out. Pertel in space. Oh, taken down. Get it back up. Get it back up. Push it. Push it. Outside. Felipe. Oh, man. I thought we had an opportunity there. Second half was much, much better. Oh, the, the, the old dreaded double click. Uh, Lorenko. All right, man of the match, one goal. All right, we'll give him some praise there. I tell you what, I think we come back. So let me play uh, MCL off camera, and we'll be back for the second leg in just a second. All right, guys, we are back. We had a 1-1 draw. We rotated our keeper, our striker, uh, a couple of players. Uh, Pepe scored in the 90th minute to rescue a point. Uh, so that's okay. Uh, keeps us in the uh, promotion area. Uh, pretty tight, but we do have really good goal differential. So pretty happy with that. Uh, Brazilian Cup, we are back today. Uh, let's see. We are slight favorites, surprisingly enough. We're going to go with our being favored tactic. <laughs> Taquez is going to be back in. Faguinho is going to be up to uh, move up to the mid. Romulo Frank. Nilo is going to come back into the back line. And we are 1-1 one, one away. So... If we can draw nil-nil or win outright, what we don't want to do is lose with them scoring more than a goal, so two or more. Go out and prove a point. Now, the big thing is they're a better side than us. They got relegated last season. Um... We got relegated, what, two seasons ago? So, no, no. Did They're going to give him a penalty. I don't think he got touched. I don't think he got touched. I'm going to be upset here. I am not going to be happy. Points at the spot. Son of a bitch. That's not good. Uh. Hello. Hey. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Well, like I said, if you can get on with as an apprentice, they, you know, most of the time they will pay for that. Or, or there's another way or, you know, there, I mean, you have to get licensed, but you know, they basically, they basically, your employer would pay for that to happen. So yeah, I just, You know, hey, you know, it never hurts to get information. I said it never hurts to get information. Sure, sure. Well, and it doesn't mean it doesn't mean you can't find somewhere more affordable, but you know, now now at least you have something something in hand to compare everything else to. You know, and that's, so that's, you know, that's actually, I, I view that as a good thing. And, you know, it gives you an idea of what's out there, but it also gives you something to compare everything else to. And, you know, and, and look at what other options are out there. So, all right. Well, Anna, I just, I texted Anna a second ago. She literally just replied to me a minute ago and she said, she's awake. She's fine. That Percy's in a foul mood. <laughs> So, 
Uh, so she still hadn't come out of out of her room, but uh, any, anyway, so but uh, but anyway, I'll keep her in the loop. And uh, but she um, she just texted me, so she's probably awake. If you want to give her a shout, all right, all right, later. All right, sorry about that. My uh, future son-in-law's out running roads today, looking at career choices and. He went to a tech school today, and it's $19,000 for tuition. So I'll try to edit that out if I remember. If I don't, that's what that conversation was about. Oh, that's brutal. So they've got the advantage right now. Uh, we need to get creative. Uh, tactics. Yes, they are on attack. Good control, up to Rooster, Foguinho, cuts it inside. Oh, that was not good. Just giving it away there, fellas. He just giving it away. All right, Columbari, reset. Romulo Frank, Foguinho, outside, nice ball, Maraha. Oh! A little ping pong action on the back line. A little miscommunication. Wow, they got a lot of fans here at our stadium. Oh, too far. God dog it. All right, you guys, well, you guys need to concentrate here, fellas. I know they don't like that, but they need to concentrate. <laughs> All right, control it. Nice. Maraha. Hello. Pretty sure we don't wear yellow kits in any way, shape, or form, so that should not be. Oh, look at the space. Nice tackle. No foul. Is he go oh there was no freaking way that was a foul. He didn't even go down. Oh. Okay. I he pointed and it was like he was pointing at the spot. I don't know. Okay, I don't know. The VAR is not real clear. <laughs> All right, Columbari. All right, we've got an opportunity here. Jefferson. He fights through a tackle. Drops it off. Shot. My God. We literally don't hear from our new boss for like two or three weeks, and he sent out like eight emails today. I have no idea what this guy is about, what he's doing, nothing. Ah. Yes, disappointing. You, watch your step. Moraha. I want to go ahead and sub him off. That's my right back. Lozano. There we go. All right. Frank Romulo. And he butchers the pass once again. Calm down. Come on, come on. All right, over the goal. They're disinterested after the shout. That's all right. Faguinho.
Fratel. I mean, we're dominating this game statistically. Push forward. Uh, I want let's bring Peppy in for Rooster. Demand more. If we lose a game like this statistically, Lozano, ah, oh, damn it. It was a nice cross into the box, but that was that was the shot. And that's the game. And we go crashing down in flames. Possession, shots on target. Chances were even. Nine long shots, that wasn't good. Corners. Passes. They want a hell of a lot more tackles, percentage-wise. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Not happy with that. All right, we pick up $883,000 in the quarterfinals. Uh, checking finances. Yeah. Hello. Hello. We're in the black. 1.4 million. Nice. We made 3.3 .3 million this year. Nice. Mm -hmm. So now that we're out of that, I want to kind of see where finances go. Uh, so we didn't win that. We were knocked out in the quarters of both competitions. Did not meet expectations here, far exceeded expectations here, and mid-table were far exceeding expectations here. Uh, let's see. We've got 20, so 20 points. So we're actually seven points clear of mid-table right now, so we're doing well. Um, we don't have any more cup action. So let's come back. Let's come back at the end of August. We've got a pair of away games there. 12th and 5th. And that'll give us another good run and maybe put, you know, so we may we may do two episodes to end a season, maybe three. Um, but again, I'd like to get through at least a couple of seasons here in Brazil. Um, you know, just to see if we can get back to that first division and 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 be there. Uh, real quick, let's uh, just check job security on people. Yeah, those I don't care about all those leagues, so we want just clubs, and I only want Brazil and Argentina. So there are no no jobs open currently. So that's fine. We're doing good. And waiting for some records to fall here. Both of these guys are on the verge of single season and club records for goals scored. Uh, I want to say somebody else was on the verge of an assist record, maybe. Moralha has got 10 assists. That is insane. And I'm keeping an eye on Taquez to see when I can offer him a contract for being in the last six months. Hopefully that comes to fruition soon. 
But uh, hey, hit that like button for me. Uh, don't feel too much pity. We did reach the quarterfinals and made some more money. And we will see you guys next episode. Have a good one. Bye.